Alright, so we're back to the only game where you can have a hoverboard surgically attached to your feet like a total douchebag. It's bro world. More wishing I would have stayed in college. Damn it. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy here. Let me die. Coming at you live from inside of the kill me crib. I have decided that there is two things that we need before we become the ultimate douchebag and finally get Jennifer. We need a Lambo and a mansion. Both things I can probably never have in real life, so I must just enjoy them in a terrible game like this. I decided to name my hoverboard Lassie. All right, Lassie, Timmy's stuck in the well and only a douchebag can get him out. Let's roll. All right, if we want a better house, we have to flirt with girls. Luckily, there's some highly educated, non-syphilis infected women right here. Whoa, baby, my name is Let Me Die. This style is so tight. All right, I'm back with a better pair of jeans that really shows off the eight pairs of socks I'm keeping in my groin. It's on, boys. She's mine, go away. I never had to fight for a woman yet. Listen up, old man. You're gonna be wishing you kept your social security check to yourself. Bam, see you on the other side of Medicare. The last thing you want is a mansion with other people living inside of it that aren't you. We have to do this. How many purses does this girl have? Yo, man. I suggest getting the speedway. You move at the speed of light. You're behind the eight ball there, partner. Lassie's already part of the family. And the girls love her. <laughs> Remember, everyone, don't you dare get off your hoverboard when you do squats. Every time I unlock new stuff and I get to hear that voice, part of my sperm count immediately shoots through the roof. This girl's probably my favorite so far. I appreciate that she beat the hell out of Santa Claus and stole one third of his outfit. 50% off tattoos. What kind do you have for sale, ma'am? I'm not gonna lie. I always wanted to look like a saber tooth tiger wiped its feet off on me. Hey man, why are you looking so depressed? This guy's like, I've been in this game for three years. Please kill me. Hey Santa, I'm back. I got the white tie and everything. Wanna feel my non-existent bicep? I'm pretty sure they didn't even render her skirt on her correctly. The amount of effort that went into making this game goes through the bottom of cranially destroying my brain cells and lands on top of incredible. I just noticed Logan's been here all alone. I need to get him a friend. He's like, it's really tough looking at depressed futureless women all day. And then I have to wait for my depressed futureless owner to come home and feed me. Hey, Douche Depot, I'm looking for something for my dead goldfish. What do you got? A judgmental teddy bear. A hideous bunny head sold. Hey, Logan, I bought you something. He's probably like, oh God, take it back. It's funny, you can make the rabbit head say no. Hey, Mr. Rabbit, would you like to be over here next to Buddha in the kill me living room? No. Yeah, you can let the girls rest their feet on you. This is what you get for being homeless in my neighborhood. Give me your track pants too, you bastard. Oh wow, he dropped his wife's shopping list. Let's get to know one another. Do you know what it was she loved about me? My friggin' tires on my car. From this camera angle, you can really see how snug my pants fit my groin. This girl's like, I've been saving up a year's worth of teddy bears for this moment. What's going on? We got ourselves a new friggin' pad. Look at this, there's no urine or feces or anything. I talked to Jennifer and she wants to meet you. If there's one thing I love, it's getting rejected right to my face. Let's roll. When meeting a girl for the first time, you should probably put away your hoverboard. We're not doing that. <laughs> Jennifer's chilling out over here and I feel like this guy's avatar is like, man, it is fantastic being stuck in this position. I like how the current objective is try to flirt with Jennifer. It lets you know that a verbal beration is like right around the corner. Jennifer, I have a hoverboard now. Do you love me? Hi, do I know you? Yeah, it's me. Let me die. You told me to meet you here. Oh, you're Joe's friend. I can finally have a gay friend. Wait, I'm not gay. <laughs> what? What makes you think I am? Because Joe told me so. You're useless to me now. Get out of my sight. Why are we going for Jennifer? This girl is awful. Also, how did I teleport inside of like the wine cooler area? Hey, um, so since the game teleported me inside of the bar where you're not supposed to be, um, does anyone want anything to drink? How you doing there, Joe? You bastard. I appreciate that you're already standing next to the knives. It's gonna make my job a lot easier. What the f***, man? <laughs> See you around, loser. I get to keep the house though, right? That moment when you chose the right color when you were randomly picking stuff for your car. Guess what? Pete is pissed off about your pants. I don't care what you say, lady. You're not gonna lotion my desk. I love that this drawer is already broed out. It has a football, cheap liquor, and a thong album. It just comes with it. I always wanted to date a girl wearing a lampshade. Your hearts will not impregnate my heart, damn it. No. Whew, that was close. 
Always use protection. In a weird turn of events, I bought a new spoiler and this girl came with it. I really don't know what else to say. Work those noodle arms. Do it. I've decided I'm going to work out until I'm a freak of nature. I need to know how stupid it gets in this game. I've got level 30 muscles and I still look like a human. This is a ripoff. Well, as human as you're allowed to look in this game. Hey baby, what do you think of my curling bar? She's probably like, is it gold plated? I'd be like, no, I'm a cheap bastard. I just sprayed it down with spray tan just like me. Taste my level 30 fists, bitch. Bruh. Hey Logan, what do you think of my new crib? He's like, stop purchasing me. No, it's fine, man. I got you TV and everything. Here, let me turn you so that you can watch it. So I'm trying to pick up girls down by the beach and Duke Nukem and his fantastic Speedo is currently playing boombox music. As a douchebag, we only have one way that we fix problems, by beating the shit out of them. Shut it down, douchebag. Was it too loud? I'm so sorry. Oh, I, I never thought we would talk this out like that. I really, I really don't know what to say now. I guess now I'm an asshole. Bye. This girl wants me to wear these pants and these shoes in order to get with her. If I buy these shoes, does like a bowl of Apple Jacks come with them? Yes, I would like your finest pastels, please. Jesus Christ, what a look. Now I know why she wanted this exact combination. Hey girl, what do you think of my Commissioner Gordon stash? Goodbye, single life. You know you want your mom to meet a girl that has the word devil tattooed on her lower back. I appreciate that from this position, I can still see my stats. Ah, we're going critical. All right, I want so many muscles. I just want to piss steroids. What is the fanciest bar we can get? Jesus, it's like the flash threw up all over a squat bar. I'm not gonna lie, my Iron Man home gym is really coming together. Joe's in my house with Jennifer. You better not have abused my dead goldfish, you bastard. What's up, bro? What the hell, man? In my crib with my girl. I don't even know you. <laughs> I was preparing her for you. I've been working out, Joe. <gasps> That's the old five finger discount. I better not see you again in the house that I basically stole from your friend. After kicking your ass, I'm gonna do some curls right in front of you. This bar has two girls on it. It's the ultimate piece of workout equipment. <laughs> oh, and they change each time. <laughs> What is this game? <laughs> oh, these two girls have matching bras. I've never felt so happy to buy a piece of equipment for a virtual house in all my life. Now I need to know, like, do terribly rendered girls come with every piece of high-end workout equipment? Let's go find out. This is a treadmill? It looks like a goddamn high-end gerbil wheel. Wouldn't want them to animate the treadmill or anything. All right, it's time to get the next crib. I'm not gonna lie. When the new mansion comes with a hideous neon bed, I'm so glad I unlocked it. Oh yeah, we're gonna be rolling on dubs now. I would like the most hideous wheels you have, please. There's an achievement called Compensate. You're goddamn right I am. Oh, it's gotta be pink. Tell me that isn't absolutely gorgeous. I don't know who this is, but it takes 40 levels of douchiness in order to meet her. Sounds like we need to do some lifting. Oh yeah, we're gonna be meeting Hamburg Gross soon. And now we're looking legit. I've changed a lot this year. This is the biggest property in town. This girl's selling me her whole house. You're really the man in town. Too bad I'm leaving the city. Unless you want to meet my best friend. She's waiting outside. Is it Jennifer? I like how they made the main girl's breasts like 80 times larger than anyone else's. Oh sweet, on top of lovely three inch thick marble countertops, Google Translate runs our entire refrigerator. Hello, Jennifer. Don't look directly at my ride, it'll make you go blind. I've got a pink Humvee with a spoiler, I've got a mansion, and I still don't have Jennifer. Also, why isn't my Jennifer poster in this place? It would look great right above the zebra print backboard. I wanna let y'all know. Real men ride their hoverboard in the snow with sandals. We're going to the goddamn mall to pick up more girls so that we could finally impress Jennifer. What's going on, flexors? It's let me die here. Come to take all you women. Who the hell are you? No, I'm serious. Who the hell are you? I can't actually see through these sunglasses. Okay, pink shirt, here we come. 
I never thought I'd have to downgrade to get the girl. I feel kind of bad. I feel like this girl's on my bed and she's like, where's this Logan I've been hearing all about? I never thought I'd have to buy so many dead fish in a video game. Yes, I would like your finest depressed fish, please. I think the thing that I love the most about the mini games now is I get a close look at exactly how hideous the outfit my character is wearing is. All right, guys, ready for this douchebag meta? We're gonna do squats with girls on the bar while another girl watches. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, hey, Logan just came in the mail. Yeah, the package was a little beat up, but honestly, he's dead anyway, so. I would like your newest awful tattoo, please. I can get the American flag on me. I'd be like, yeah, just rip this one off and give me this one instead. And she'd be like, it's attached to your skin. And I'd be like, yeah, I got plenty of skin. And she's like, from where? And I'm like, have you seen all the girls I've been bringing home? Oh, it's fantastic. Now this look is almost complete. I've got a girl that wants me to wear ripped up leopard pants. I'm not gonna ask any questions. The fact that I have to change my paint from my beautiful pink kills me. Oh, you can have the MIB chair? Hell yes. My hat can't even contain my hair anymore. Jennifer, for God's sakes, what more do you want? I need five more levels of douchebaggery. See, it's not about skipping leg day. It's just I haven't used my legs in like two years. Finally, I get to go back to the pink. I have now gone out with so many girls that there's no girls in the entire shopping center anymore. My characters abducted them all. That means we're a level 55 douchebag. It's time to get Jennifer, God damn it. Jennifer, for God's sakes, I've dated the entire state. You're the only person left. Yes. Hey, let me die. Did you know I always had a crush on you? Are we gonna do it or what? I love the very romantic conversations these characters have. It's very weird having fun times with all my girls with both of the goldfish staring at me all the time. Logan's like, God damn it, let me die. Couldn't you face me that way? That was amazing, but I don't know what happened. Now that I'm with her, the only thing I want is another chick. I'm back, bitch. Nope. What the heck? I can hear everything you're saying, douchebag. You got your Jennifer quest completed. Premium girls unlocked. Is this a real thing? Jennifer will now follow you everywhere and give you a refill of energy at any moment. This is amazing. She's basically like my own personal vending machine. All right, I gotta know. What is a premium girl? This is a premium girl. Looks like all the other girls. Other than having to deal with unending breakdowns and relationship commitments, I think that we've managed to finally do it. Hey Jennifer, I'm out of Red Bull. <laughs> Energy full. Mansion, pink Humvee, squat bar where you actually squat girls. I think I'm gonna leave y'all with this image right here and reflect on the fact that I spent real money on this game. <laughs> anyway folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Bro World. Till next time, stay foxy and much love. <laughs>